Happy Monday, everybody. Welcome to the vlog. A new week, another week in a year. The week's flying by, um, and Monday just seems to come around so quick. Um, but yeah, welcome to the vlog. Um, join me this week and see what I get up to. Um, it's a normal school and work week. Well, almost, because it is Anzac Day this Thursday, so not all... Um, normal because we'll be having Thursdays off so um, it's another four day week. Um, next week will be our first full five day week back at school because the boys only started on Wednesday last week. They uh, um, had Thursday off because they went well and Friday we went to Hull's Gap so um, they only had one day back at school so they've got four days this week. Um, but anyway, welcome to the vlog. I'm going to round the kids up and get them moving, make my coffee and head out the door to drop the boys at school and get myself to work. I found Otto here and Strawberry. Yeah. <laughs> and Bumblebee is there too. Yeah. Where's Bumblebee? Behind. <laughs> um, Otto is dressed, he's just laying on the floor in his blanket. Um, this is my Oscar was last seen on the couch eating his toast, but the bathroom lights are on, so he must be in the shower. But he's left his toast plate there, so he can get that um, when he comes out. And this is my next top coffee machine. <laughs> right, and I am just about to make my coffee. Um, but I quickly just wanted to um, uh, um, give just a little shout out. I know my channel is only very small, but some of um, my watchers may also watch this channel as well. So the channel is called Life in a Mum Shell. Well, the channel was called that, but it is no longer called that because um, YouTube have deleted her channel. So um, I enjoyed watching her vlogs. Um, she's a mum, um, got three boys. Um, she does grocery hauls, family vlogs, meal planning, meals of the week. Um, I love watching her meals of the week videos. Um, and I hadn't seen her for a while. And um, yeah, I tried to search, but I couldn't remember what her channel name was called. And then randomly, um, a grocery haul popped up last night and it was from another Aussie vlogger. Um, and I seen the familiar face. So um, I messaged her and said, can you please tell me what your channel name um, was before? So I could mention it. So if any of you did watch Life in a Mum Shell, um, her channel has been deleted. Um, she did not get any warnings or anything, just completely deleted. So. Um, her new channel is up and running um, about three weeks, I think it looks like when I look back on the uploads. So there's a few videos on there. Um, so even if you haven't, maybe go and check her out. Um, yeah, she does um, some good content on there. So it's another Aussie vlogger. Um, I might actually link it in the, the description because being a small channel, I don't think you can actually search for them. Um, so I will put her link in um, my description box so you can see her. Um, but yeah, she's got about maybe six videos on there if I remember correctly. Um, I've only watched her first one when she lets us know. So she's not going to be um, featuring her kids because she thinks it's probably a kid violation or something, which scares me um, because oh, my channel is small, I know. I'm trying to grow it. And um, speaking of, I have reached 504 subscribers, so I am so um, ecstatic about that. Um, okay. My yeah, my goal was to reach 500, so which I've just passed that. Um, and yeah, my next goal is a thousand, but no time limit for when that happens. So um, I know it will happen because I, uh, I've i made it to 500. So um, yeah, but what I was saying, I don't think you can actually search for channels that um, are just small or starting out. So I will link her in the, um, the description box so you can check her out. And if you are like me and did watch her and wonder where she went, that's what happened. I'll look at this adorable things in the background. Yeah, uh, we do. Like it does. Yeah, sure. we do have a new red panda to the family. Um, Ella. Yeah. She come from the Hall's Gap Zoo, so. Um, I don't know where. Right yeah, we'll find her. Um, we'll introduce you to Ella. Um, after school. Anyway. Um. 
Yes, that's what I wanted to stop on and say. Now I need to make my coffee um, and get out the door. Um, we have basketball training after school tonight. I've just found out as well. So <laughs> four o'clock on a Monday is going to be basketball training. Not going to lie. And I did say to the coach, I was really, really hoping for a Thursday night basketball training because that meant both the boys were on the same night. So um, I was so keen to have nothing on a Monday night because we've had cricket training on Mondays, but now we've got basketball training Monday. So Monday night basketball training, Tuesday, Wednesday, and nothing Thursday, um, Otto's basketball training. Oh, you found Ella? Um, Friday night, nothing now, there's no cricket. And Saturday, two games of basketball. This is Ella. <laughs> this is little Ella. And she come from the Halls Gap Zoo. Um, she's very, very similar to Snowy. Um, yeah, I think she's like, might be Snowy's twin, but this is definitely Ella. Anyway, ramble over. Um, it's 8.29. I need to get moving. <laughs> Just walking in the door from work and I have a Timu package on my doorstep. So, um, I don't know if there's much in there, but let me get inside. I decided that I was going to quickly get changed before I... Um, I did the package because uh, we've got a rush of basketball by four o'clock. Um, but I don't think my Timu um, order is that big of a order to do a whole um, separate vlog. So I'm just going to unbox it um, here. And I just need to yep, pull this thing out. What's that? That, 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 just the bag. Like, right. There's nothing else under that. Um, I did just buy a um another like cooler bag type thing, which I'll sorry, but I was making sure there was nothing underneath that. But I don't think there is. Not a very exciting thing, but. Anyway, it's just like, you know, an insulated, um, <laughs> a big massive bag. Um, it's like the Coles ones um, with the strawberries that you might have seen. Um, I know Bronwyn's seen it because she likes it. Um, but just, yeah, for when we go away, it's handy to pack a lot of um, food into. I bought this, which is a leopard heart hanger, which I'm gonna put in my car. So I'll rip that open now oh yeah it's like oh it's a smelly thing <laughs> i was gonna say it's like a smelly thing but it doesn't smell but um it definitely smells oh it's nice i did not know it smelled i thought it was just a decoration doesn't even say your fragrance but it's a really manly um cologne scent so um yeah doubly happy i just bought it because it looked um Nice and leopard apprenti. <laughs> um, the next thing I'm not going to open um, because this is for Otto, so I'll get him to open it. I'll put it back inside the Timu bag, but it's um, a red panda throw rug. Um, yeah. No. Yes, it is. I was going to say, I thought this was the throw rug, but no. Um, this is the, yeah, definitely a red panda throw rug. This is a bath mat because um, I need a new bath mat and I've seen this was a long style and that's what I need for my ensuite. Um, I need longer than wider so it's only this width so that wide but it is this long so that's how long it is longer about as long as my arms span out so that's going to be perfect because it's the width i need to stop the water going out and most bath mats um are just fractionally short from the width of my shower so hopefully this works good if it does i'll get another one um but it's really thick um on the back and nice and soft and fluffy like the kmart ones on there that's what that is i can't remember what i ordered in this 
that's usually what happens in my TV. This is a small. There is one more item that got sent separately, um, which is just a cardigan, which hopefully that will arrive tomorrow and I'll show you that tomorrow. Pretty sure the tracking said that. Um, this is <laughs> another tripod. It's just a little mini one. Hopefully it's like a solid one. Hopefully it's easy for me to use. I think this just, there is a fly that is flying around in here and it is annoying me. This does not feel that for quality. Feels like my phone is gonna break it. Oh my goodness. It does expand out, but I don't think it's gonna be any good. I don't think my phone's gonna get held on it. Could be wrong. Anyway, it might be just a good one just to a handheld one. It's such, such poor quality. <laughs> this is disastrous. Yeah, I, I don't rate this. <laughs> oh, I'm next excited about this. It's um, for my car screen. I'm kind of here for this. I don't need it now, but it's one of those sun you know, visor things. But it is upside down. It's a panda, so it sits, yeah, across your front windscreen. Oh, I can't even see what you can see, because I'm consumed by it, but um, that is the gist of it. I'm gonna, I'll put it on my car later, and I'll show you what it looks like. I don't have time to do it now. Um, I might have time to do it now. If I have time to do it before I get the boys from school, I'll do it. If not, I'll just show you later. But that's it, that's all that I got. So, uh, the red panda throw, that cooler bag, this, this rubbish, I'm basically saying rubbish. Um, this, I can smell this from sitting on the bench, and the bath mat, which I'm happy about. So happy days with that. Um, anyway, here, yeah, home from work. <laughs> Basketball training at four o'clock. Um, so Otto and I have to, Still in an hour because it's not worth coming home but I did order some croc charms off a lady that's selling them here um, in our town so I'm gonna go and pick them up off her I think in the hour that um, we're home so when we get them I'll show you but oh this smells sensational oh it smells like one of Oscar's colognes even better it's leopard print so that's my favorite the panda thing will probably be my favorite after that but Anyway, um, ramble over. I'm going to, it's three o'clock. I've got to get the boys soon, but I'm going to go have a cold drink and, um, don't know what else I'll do until 20 minutes is up. <laughs> Nothing probably. I've got the boys from school. Um, Aldo is waiting in the car with me. Leon and Oscar have just gone in to get change for training and then we're heading back out the door. <laughs> this is going to be Monday from now on. Um, four o'clock is his training time. Um, and cricket was also at four o'clock training time as well, but cricket training went for two hours, so we couldn't really, um, we could be a little bit late. Basketball training is like one hour, so they need that whole one hour. Um, anyway, we're just waiting for them boys to come back. Then um, Oscar, no, Otto, has got his snacks, which I think he's into already. Um, he's got snacks packed in his lunchbox. He's got his iPad. But um, Otto and I are going to go and pick up croc charms that we ordered. So, My new crocs? Yeah. We're picking up your ones that you selected and Oscar's ones. Oh, he's into snacks already. <laughs> caramel. Oh, he's got a caramel piece, right? Um, two left. Oh, so that means you've eaten two because you had four little yeah, Easter eggs. I'm about to eat them. Mm. Um, <laughs> what else was I going to say? Oh, I don't think I said this morning, but. Hey, good. Oh, sorry. 
I don't actually think I said this morning, but when I woke up, um, I didn't check my YouTube vlog because I always have it processing overnight on Sunday to upload um, at 7 a.m. Monday morning. And I didn't check it straight away. And when I did check it, my whole video had been blocked for copyright. And I thought maybe it was because I had the Essendon theme um, song in, Essendon Footy Club theme song. But it wasn't. It was um, related to the footy. So they completely blocked my video because um, there was like 31 seconds um, of footage that I'd recorded off the TV just after Essendon beat Western Bulldogs. So all it was was um, the... Ted Witten, EJ Witten um, Bulldogs Award. When the Bulldogs play um, this round or whatever. Um, yeah, it was them speaking. So that's what it was. Anyway, <laughs> I'll finish that story. Anyway, the boys are back. We need to get to training. <laughs> I think I was finishing off saying about my copyright um, block on YouTube. Um, yeah, I was thinking it was going to be the Essendon theme song, but it was actually just um, some talking. So the Ted Witten, EJ Witten Award, whatever it was, for they were presenting that, and they just called the Essendon captain up to um, get presented with the cup, and yeah, just said a little bit about that, the game, and uh, that was it. That was what I got copyrighted for, so... Um, I will know that you are not um, <laughs> allowed to film that anymore, but the theme song was allowed, so I kept that in. Um, <laughs> I've dropped Leon and Oscar at basketball. I've just picked up this little um, goodies, goodie bag, so um, they're for Oscar and Otto. <laughs> I'll show you Oscars, um, and then I'll show you Otto's. Uh, let me just get them out of here with me. <coughs> uh, I thought I got also a basketball one, but maybe I didn't get your basket one, Otto. So Oscar got a KFC one because he loves KFC. Twisties, he loves Twisties. Steph Curry, obviously, because he likes basketball. Golden State Warriors, his favorite basketball team. Oh, that one's Otto's. Oscar the Grouch, say no more. Up the Dons, Essendon, <laughs> and a big M. So they are Oscars ones, and uh, I, hmm, I thought I actually ordered just a basketball for Otto, but I must know if that's okay. I will order more off this lady. Um, <coughs> oh, that's what it's stuck in my throat. So Otto's are. This Roblox character, this Roblox character, a Nike shoe, and a little controller. So, um, these ones are yours, Otto. Roblox character, a Nike shoe. I got your controller. <laughs> And the other Roblox guy. Yeah. yeah. Happy with him? Thanks, Mum. Thanks, Mum. <laughs> it's too engrossing his iPad. Um, anyway. <laughs> um, I am going to go quickly go to the servo and check the air pressure in my tyre because um, in horse cap on the weekend I did have um, a flat tyre, not completely flat, but it had gone down to like 14 pounds of pressure when we run like 36. So, um, <coughs> and of course there was only one 
air compressor pump in Hallscap. If you've been to Hallscap, you know. Um, it's not very much there. But it was out of order. And when we had the flat tyre, chance I can imagine if it was out of order. I mean, it was out of order. So we had to wait. Um, we got uh, to stall our at somewhere. I don't know where we got to, Servo, and we re-pumped it up and it hadn't lost like 14 pounds, so, no, it was down to 14 pounds from 36. So, um, we do have a little air compressor thing at home, which Shane said, check it out, but it's going to be easy to do at the Servo. So, I'm going to do a quick stop at the Servo, then head back to get um, Oscar, and maybe Leon. I think I'm taking Leon home. Anyway, that's what I'm doing now. home from a basketball training finally it's quarter past six <laughs> and we got Macca's Happy Meals today so I got cheeseburger Happy Meal um Oscar got cheeseburger Happy Meal and Otto got nugget Happy Meal uh, yeah so <laughs> that is our tea because Otto and I did actually go to the supermarket to get some chicken because I didn't get any out but they were out they said there's a shortage on chicken so um, that's my excuse for Maccas. Um, anyway, I will make sure I get chicken out of the freezer tonight so it defrosts overnight and ready for tea tomorrow night. But I'm just going to eat my Happy Meal and, um, yeah, watch some YouTube. Should have got my pyjamas on, but I've already sat down now, so that'll be the next job I do. I did make it into my PJs and I've just been putting Oscar's croc charms onto his croc so I'll show you what they look like. It looks pretty good. He's just missing hot Cheetos but other than that he's got pretty much all his favourites on there. So his twisties, chocolate big am, playstation controller, don't know if it's a playstation controller but oh, it's yeah. a gaming controller, KFC, a croc, on a croc. <laughs> Oscar, the Grouch, Essendon, Papadons, Golden State Warriors, S Steph Curry from the Golden State Warriors, and a little like flaming basketball. So they look pretty good. <laughs> he's crocked out his crocs. <laughs> For real. And Otto, he's too busy on his game to actually put his on, but <laughs> we'll get his on maybe tomorrow. <laughs> Otto could not miss out. He heard us talking about the croc charms. So he had to get his croc charms put onto his. Um, he got his two Roblox characters, his controller and his Nike one. Um, plus he already had um, these Prime bottles. One he got from Ty and the other one he got for Christmas, I'm pretty sure. So that is, um, yeah. Oscar's laughing about something. Oh, just sorry. Yeah. Should I tell you? No. Stop. Happy Tuesday. Just waiting for the boys to walk out the door. And then we are off to our work and a school day. Um, I've got some um, Cabana bikinis and dip for lunch today. Oh, there's Otto. Who's he got? Ella and yeah. Snowy. They're the twins. <laughs> and here comes Oscar. <laughs> The twins. Um, but yeah, we're about to get in the car and start our day. So the girls are going for show and tell because it's Otto's free choice show and tell day. There they are, little cuties. <laughs> you can't tell the difference. No. I just did the most super quick stop at Rebel to pick up Otto's basketball shoes. And now I'm on my way to work, but I'll quickly show these when I get in the car. The only reason I remember this is because I got a text message reminding me to pick them up. Um, but, oh, they, oh, they're so cute. I can't wait to see him wearing them. They are little Nike Jordans, so, oh, and he's even got, there's a little sticker inside the box. It's just in there. So he'll be so happy he's got a... Jordan sticker, but I'll pop those in his car seat for when he, um, take this receipt off. Um, did 
did I go in the seat? Don't miss it. Of course I did. <laughs> anyway, I'll um, put them in his seat before he gets in the car tonight. But now, I'm going to work. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'm trying to pack into my garage and I was not even looking. I was looking down the road. Um, <laughs> and I was nearly... Um, not even backing up the driveway. Anyway, take two and I'll get up the driveway. Um, I am at a finished work. Uh, got out on pretty good time. Oops. Um, and I have packages at my front door. Um, there's actually three packages at my front door. Uh, one of them is not exciting at all. Two of them are exciting. One's I think for Shane and the other one hopefully is my other part of the team we order. So I'll just get in. Um, I need to close my garage door down first <laughs> and then open it back up because I need to leave enough room um, for when I open up my tailgate because it's automatic. It just when you push the button it opens. So I need to leave enough room. So I put my roller door down, <laughs> turn my front camera on so I can see how close I'm getting and I get to a certain point. And then I'm right. Anyway, let's get these pages exciting and not exciting off my front doorstep. Oh. I need to do something about this ant issue on my letterbox because oh, I dropped it because I don't want to get ants on me. They're all inside my letterbox nothing in there but oh my gosh there's way more on this side ah there's one on my thumb get off um, but yeah there's way more oh. gross are they sometimes they go along the front yes they are going along the front ah. Oscar has to mow the lawns after school but you can see them all along up there. I'm following an air trail. Probably making you dizzy. But you can see them all travelling back to the line of them. Anyway, enough about ants. <laughs> That's the not so exciting package I'm talking about. Um, this one I think is from Timu. And this one, I'm pretty sure this is Shane's one. Yes, that one. Um, that one there is Shane's. He ordered some uh, driving lights for the ASX. But these two are definitely for me. <laughs> definitely the basket of ironing. Oh, scoot in. All right, I've put Maddie's ironing down. I am actually quite happy with that. It's not very big at all. I'm hoping this is my Timu um, part two. It's one thing. It is. <laughs> I was worried it might smell. Oh, I like the colour. This is the colour of it. Hmm. I'd say it was opened somewhere along the line. Because that's open. Anyway, this is the cardigan. Oh. It's um just a hooded cardigan. It has a bit of a weird smell. But I'll wash it and it'll be fine. Doesn't seem that good quality. But <laughs> it'll do. Um, oh my god. It's like <laughs> ginormous. Anyway, it's got pockets, it's got a hood. It'll be fine. <laughs> Maybe it might shrink a little bit. Um, it'll be fine. Um, 
just to wear over my t-shirt to go to work in. That's what I mainly got it for, but I need to get it off because it's got a weird smell. Um, anyway, that's the exciting update. I've been to work, I'm home. Uh, I set my dishwasher timer this morning. It's got 12 minutes left, so I'll get to unload that before I get the boys from school. But um, yeah, I'm not up to much else before I go and get them. Uh, but as I said, Oscar is going to mow the lawn, so um, I'll uh, give you a before and after of the lawns because they are desperately need needing mowed. Back in the car again to go and get the boys from school, but I'm leaving a little bit earlier because I'm going to run into Woolworths and use this voucher that I got from <laughs> the recycling um, hole in the wall thing. <laughs> um, <laughs> <coughs> if you missed that on um, last week's vlog, we took our cans to the recycling uh, little wall thing, <laughs> I don't know what they're called, containers, and the machine became full. We normally have bank transfer as our option of payment, but apparently when the machine is full, it just automatically gives you a Woolworths voucher. It does not transfer the funds to your account. So, um... Either way, we would use the Woolworths voucher, but we are using all the money for that to go into a separate account and, um, yeah, savings for holidays. So um, we could have had another $8.80 in there, but I've got that there. Um, I need to just quickly go into Woolworths to um, grab um, chicken because um, let me explain why I was going to get chicken out of the freezer I need to get along, get on my way otherwise I'm still hitting, sitting here and it's time to get the boys um, so I've said before but I've recently just joined the Everyday Extra Awards Awards? <laughs> Rewards is the word I'm looking for um <laughs> I'll tell you the funny bit about that in a minute. Um, but I did join the Everyday Extra. I signed up for the one year, um, $70, and I got a 30 day free trial. Um, um, backtracking, <laughs> I was gonna say, oh my gosh, bear with me guys, bear with me. I'm trying to say too many things in a little amount of time. I have a deal on there for 5,000 points for Milk Run. Spend $50 um, and I get 5,000 points. So last night when I was going to pull a chicken out, I thought, no, it's all right. I won't pull a chicken out. I'll order some chicken tenderloins on um, Milk Run because Milk Run prices are just slightly a little bit higher. But um, if I could get the chicken and get 5,000 points plus a few other things, um, they have OMO for 50% off which brings it down to $15 for two litres, which is a pretty good price, is a really good price for two litres in my room. Anyway, so I thought, I won't get the chicken out of the freezer, I will um, do an order on Milk Run. <laughs> Went to do the Milk Order, um, Milk Run order, and chicken tenderloins are temporary and available online. <laughs> so they weren't that planned, so then I also had no chicken out. Um, so I was just gonna duck to Coles or Aldi, um, but I'm like, no, I'm gonna use that voucher. Um, anyway, backtrack to the other thing I started to say when I joined up to the Everyday Rewards. Um, so I decided I'd pay the $70 up front. Um, you save a little bit of money. Been doing it monthly, it's out of the road, and I've got it for a year. So I was in my free trial period still. I have two days left, one day now actually the two days when I decided this and I had a notification on my rewards app that they've got a sale on the everyday um, extra for $35 for the whole 12 months so I checked and they were still going to be charging me $70 in like two days time um, yeah, so I cancelled my um, everyday extra and once my 30 days is up, which is tomorrow, I'll reactivate um, my everyday extra and I'll pay $35 for the year and save myself $35. Um, yeah, obviously I won't get this for 33 days again, but uh, I'm like, they could have just offered it to me for $35 instead of charging me $70, but I did say that was the reason I was cancelling um, when I cancelled my um, membership thing. I said the reason was I have an offer for $35, so I'm cancelling and going to resubscribe. 
anyway, that was my little Woolworths ramble. But so far, um, I am getting way more benefits from Woolworths than I do with flybys. Um, I just haven't been getting the deal deals with flybys. Um, yes, I thought let's switch. Oh my god. I'm not really sure some people well unless you have a big car I guess you don't really think but um stopping to let people at the crossing don't want to look like I'm talking to myself um <laughs> I don't think people actually realize when you have a big car that um you and another car don't fit around the corners so I had to wait anyway let's hope they have um chicken tenderloins in store, which I'm sure they will. Anyway, let's go to Woolworths. All right, Woolworths is done. <laughs> I got, well you just see what I got because I filmed it, but um, apples, bananas, Tim Tams because they're on sale for $2.50. So I uh, stashed them up in the cupboard for when we feel like biscuits because um, they've been so expensive, Tim Tams. Like, <laughs> so $2.50 is a good price. So I got one caramel, one double coat. Double coat, uh, our favorite and our choice of Tim Tams. And I've still got the chicken, but the tenderloins, I had to get the macro free range chicken, which is a little bit more expensive, so they don't have any other tenders um, in store, so maybe there's a shortage, because we also did go to get some in OGA yesterday, and there was none either, so maybe the tenderloin shortage is happening. Anyway, I um, it's now 3.25, so... I'll be going in good time just to drive in the drive through and pick up the boys. I did actually forget to get all those shoes um, up and put them in his seat. Oh. Oh, anyway, to school I go. I can already see it looks busy there. Oh, I might be able to get straight across. Let's hope. Yes, it looks like I can. Perfect. Okay, bye. I can see Otto, but I cannot see Oscar. Um, I don't think Oscar has a message to me to say. No, he has not messaged me to say come to high school to pick up, but it looks like I'm going to do a high school pick up. Unless he comes running up the gate any longer, but uh, any longer, any minute, but I don't think so because it looks like they've got all the kids up here. I was wrong. Oscar is there. Do you have your drink bottle? Shut it off off my hand now. Oh. Hey, we're, we're downstairs. Oh, no. Hard, shut it hard. Shut it hard. Is that your basketball shoes? Show me. Where are they? Why? In the box on the floor. Did you get them from Rebel? Yeah. Can you? Oh. Can you get them? I love it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I hate the other Jordans because I hate them. You hate them? No, because they got me red ones. <laughs> you don't have to hate the other Jordans because you got new ones. Yeah. You can like them both. Yeah, I see what Yeah. Uh, well, we've been to Rebel Sports. Um, okay. And Otto. 
This is Otto's new basketball for training. Um, this is Otto's collection of shoes in the car. He always takes his shoes off in the car and we can never find them. But he can come back and get them. I do have a surprise, just hang on. <laughs> um, you got to unpack your lunchbox first. For it? Yeah. yeah. Unpack school bag, lunchbox. No. We went um, straight from school to Rebel Sport because um, when I was in there this morning, they had all their basketball shoes on sale, which I already knew they were on sale, but I didn't realise they had them in store. Um, so we got new um, basketball shoes, <laughs> Snowy and Ella, um, and then the boys got <laughs> basketballs for training. Um, <laughs> We've got many basketballs, but we're going to train train these. Save these specifically yeah. for training. Um, he comes off school with his new shoes, so I'll flip the camera around and show you just his shoes. Yeah. All right, I'll have to spin around. They're a pretty... Whoa, whoa. That was uh, snowy. Go in the light a bit more. Yeah. Put them to the side. Yeah. They are pretty cool. So he got them. He also got a new basketball, which I think is still in the car. Um, but I think I was saying that these are just for training only. So they're not to go out on our basketball court. Well, um, yeah, but once Oscar brings these in. Um, Otto also got another pair of Jordans. So... So These are the Jordans that he got. And the Red and the black ones. And there's another one. And yeah, I showed them this morning after I picked them up. They're just basketball shoes. Mm -hmm. So they're just for basketball games only. Mm -hmm. And these are just for casual wear. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'll get Oscar's basketball out of the car. So this is the one that he got. Um, so that's his also just for training only. And finally, a new pair of shoelaces for Otto's, uh, Oscar's shoes. Uh, it's 4.30. Oh, it's now 4.30 and as much as Oscar doesn't want to, he has to go and mow the lawns. Mow the lawns is what I said. <laughs> um, these are Oscar's a little bit closer up. Whoops. What size are these? They're eight and a half. I think they're eight and a half. Yeah. Happy, happy. I'm about to give Otto his little package from Timu. Um, he's going to open it. <laughs> he's still in his school shirt, so... I'm trying to not show his school logo as well, but this is yours, Otto. Is there something in there? Yeah. I'm picking a keyboard. Picking a keyboard? Yeah. Oh. So Oscar can have his own. I don't know. I don't know if it's a keyboard. There you go. Oh, that's soft. Here, yeah, I'll hold it up and open. I'll open it up and show you. Show it to me. Show it to me. Right there. Right there. Oh. Hop down, hop down. Because you logo's on there. Yeah. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> what do you think of that? They're cute. Oh, that's so adorable. Oh, it's really good. Oscar is um, firing up the wall mower. Well, he's already fired up, so. Gonna do the quick before and after.
I finally just put this on the front of the car to test it out. It looks pretty cool. <laughs> Just coming out to check up um, and help Oscar finish off the lawns and the sun is setting over there in the distance so pretty but looks like rain maybe oh, now that Oscar's done the lawns and I've supervised all of that I now get to go in and cook tea clean up and um yeah do more fun mum things <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. I nearly lost my can off there. Um, I've been sitting on the couch, eating my tea, watching YouTube, um, and I'm finally just taking my um, plate and can to the kitchen um, and going to be making my departure for the day into bed it's very soon. It's nine o'clock, <laughs> so I won't be far off going to bed. Um, anyway, uh, let me sit here. Oh, there we go. Um, yeah, so it's raining, but it was so super muggy. I don't even know if I said it earlier. It was so, so muggy today. Um, 24 or something like that. So um, for autumn, I'm going to say winter. It's not winter yet. I'll let you guys know when it's winter. I'll be celebrating when it's winter. Um, but it's 24 today and it's going to be 13 tomorrow. So the weather here is so crazy up and down. Um, madness. But anyway, I'm um, yeah going to be heading into bed soon. Um, probably just going to unload the dishwasher because um, GSD. Hmm. I do have a load of washing I need to hang on the clothes area as well. Because also GSD, I'm trying to keep up with washing and um, get a load done at night and then um, hang it on the clothes area and then just be rotating and swap it. Oh, there's Otto slinking in the background, dragging my blanket. Oh, uh, you're sleeping with me? No, He's sleeping with me. Just me? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Both boys slept with me last night. What? I sleep You both did. Oscar did too. Yeah, no. It was not good. No, we've got a king size bed, but it still was not good, trust me. <sighs> anyway, <laughs> um, I will talk about that with Oscar, whether Oscar's sleeping with me or not. But Shane's home tomorrow night, so it's the last night Otto gets to sleep with me. But anyway, <sighs> I'm off to bed as soon as I unload the dishwasher and hang my washing on the clothes area. <laughs> Work tomorrow, actually, was the other thing I was going to come on and say. That I am working on Wednesday. Um, but I won't be working Thursday because it's Anzac Day. Um, also Christie's birthday. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm not working Thursday. Um, anyway, off to the canteen tomorrow. So, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not going to know what day it is. And um, Nicole actually messaged me just before to cancel cleaning this Friday. So it's just Mel's on Friday. So my week for the rest of the week is going to be who knows what's going on. Anyway, um, ramble over. I have my load of washing on the air. I'm just going to hang up my cardigan um, on a hanger because it'll just dry better than on there. But I have that on there. Now I have to get past. Oscar's bike, which is in here. <laughs> um, and go back to the laundry and turn the light off. Whoa. <laughs> oh. I think Otto's, yes, Otto's TV is on in here. Otto's light is on. <laughs> I need to work out how to turn this off. Just 
time to wake up, Otto. Happy Wednesday. <laughs> Trying to wake Otto up, but he keeps going back to sleep. <laughs> Both Oscar and Otto had a sleepover with me again last night. So they're back to their own beds tonight because Shane is home. But Otto has swimming lessons with school today. So his bag's already packed for swimming. I've already packed his school bag with his lunchbox and his reader and his drink bottle that is not his drink bottle because Otto keeps seeing to bring his drink bottle home. I reckon that's three out of five nights a week he forgets to bring his drink bottle home. Um, anyway, so he's just got a plastic water bottle to take to school today. Um, the same as yesterday because he did not bring it home <laughs> Monday or Tuesday. Anyway, Otto's swimming bag is packed, but I'm not sure if Otto's going to get to swimming today. Wish me luck. Oscar is already up and had his breakfast and in the shower. It's eight o'clock. I need to get myself in the shower, so I need to get um, Otto up and moving. But anyway, happy Wednesday. I've got a battle. I have dropped both of the boys off at school and eating my toast on the way to work this morning because I'm so hungry. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to up, drive to work, finish my coffee and then uh, get in for a day of Wednesday work. I'm just getting home from work and I have got um, hot dog rolls that I ordered from the bakery. So that must mean we're having hot dogs um, for tea. Oh, I've got <laughs> my containers from lunch to bring in as well. Sorry. Um, yeah, I've also got my containers from lunch that I'm bringing in as well. Um, but I also did a um, milk run delivery um, order, not delivery, a milk run order, and that is just arrived at my door. Um, so I, <laughs> I'm actually going to do um, like a little grocery haul with that as well. So um, I'll just <laughs> tell you the prices that I spent, what they are in store, etc., etc., etc. You would have already seen it on the channel because it would have been uploaded. But let's get the order from my door. Sitting down to have hot dogs and watch. Happy Thursday. Oh, we, um, last night <laughs> had a super low key night. Chain got home from uh, Warnable about six o'clock. Um, and we just had hot dogs for tea. We, uh, started, <laughs> we have started, we have started watching, um, I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. So we watched a couple episodes of that last night. Um, and I just sat on the couch, went to bed about 10 o'clock and might have been a bit later. I don't know. Um, <laughs> but I didn't really feel anything after. After, um, I got home from school and work. Uh, so today's probably going to be about the same because it's a day off, Thursday, Anzac Day. Also, Christy's birthday. Happy birthday, Christy. Um, but by the time this is up, it'll already be two weeks past or, yeah, two weeks past Christy's birthday. So long gone. Um, anyway, it is Christy's birthday today. <laughs> oh, I've got hiccups. Um, Anzac Day, um yeah lest we forget um so the boys have the day off school i've got the day off work shane's got the day off work we're all at home so we're actually gonna have um maccas for breakfast so shane and oscar have gone to get that we ordered it on the app um otto is still asleep but i've said that he can't sleep in past nine o'clock so we'll wake him up it is 8 48 um so he has like 12 minutes left to sleep and then we're waking him up so he can have a little bit of a sleep in but not a massive sleep in like he would like so when Shane and Oscar get back it'll probably be closer to nine so he'll be able to hop up and have his um hot cakes but um I'm in search of my boots <laughs> um, oh they're right there um so 
well, that's what I'm going to do is get my grits on and wait for um, Shane and Oscar to come back. Um, and I don't even need to make coffee because we got the um, the brekkie deal thing on the Macca's up. So coffee is included. So I'm just going to sit on the couch and wait for my coffee to be delivered to me. <laughs> Shane is trying to get me to... Um, my arm's getting sore. I need to be up here. Oh, that's better. <laughs> um, oh, I still look half asleep anyway. Um, Shane wanted me to get, oh, he's back. Shane wanted me to get, go and get the breakfast. But I said, um, nobody does much for me. So it'd be nice if, um, you know, someone did that for me because I'm always on doing everything for everyone else. So I said, maybe you could go and get the Macca's Brecky because that'd be a nice thing for someone to do something for me. <laughs> anyway, he's back. So I'm making my way to the couch once I, um, get my ugly boots on um, because it's cold and raining out there just the way I like it so I'm gonna get these ugly boots on and um well I don't think it's raining at the minute I got washing <laughs> drying up here um it has been raining but it's not particularly raining at the minute but um it's my kind of weather out there anyway sorry Christy you didn't get a nice sunny day for your birthday um but happy Thursday um if I do anything exciting, you guys will know. Didn't I make it to the couch before the boys got in with breakfast, but coffee and I for Shane. And um, we uh, got an orange juice with Otto's meal, but it actually says orange fruit drinks. I don't know if Maccas have changed um, their drink to the fruit drink or it's always said that, but we'll give it a try anyway. But, Oh, focus. There is all our goodies in there. You look cozy there. I know. Feels good, looks good. You're still tired. Oh, you're loving it? Clearly, it is much later in the evening. Um, it's dark, I'm in the car. I just quickly drove to the supermarket because I needed to get cash out for my dad um, to give him tomorrow. And I didn't want to go to the ATM, obviously, because it's dark. So I'm like, oh, I'll just go into the supermarket and um, get buy something and get cash out for him that way. So, and uh, buy something I did. I got a um, super bargain, which I'll show you when I get home, because I put them in the boot and then started to drive off and realised, oh, I should have just filmed when I was in there, but I was also actually talking to Christy, so I couldn't um, film and talk to Christy at the same time, so that's the real reason I didn't actually um, film them when I was in there, but um, yeah, super, super bargain, so, but now it's created another job when I get home, but it doesn't matter, because I really haven't been doing anything today, so it'll give me a sense of GSD. <laughs> anyway, um, I'll show you that when I get home. I'm just rambling, but I uh, need to get home. And um, also, forgot to wash the boys' white school shirts. Oh, I'm so confused what day it is. Obviously, it's Thursday. I worked yesterday on a Wednesday, Anzac Day, public holiday today. So, no idea what is even going on in my world. Um, and I had all the boys' white shirts soaking, which I normally wash on a Wednesday um, or the weekend, depending on which day it falls on that I do it. Um, but yeah, it was a Wednesday this week and forgot because, uh, yeah, and I'm just thinking about, yeah, I've got everything. I've got bread out of the freezer. Um, I've got enough snacks, everything. Um, and yeah, I don't have their white shirts all washed, so I need to go and put them on when I get home and I'll just hang them and they'll dry overnight. But we soon will be getting a dryer, um, just, you know, trying to save a little bit more money for the dryer that we want. Um, and then that's going to be another lifesaver. Um, still, we'll try and get stuff hung out where I can, but for underclothes, it's going to be a lifesaver. Um, anyway, I'm almost back home, so I will show you when I get in my um, little purchases that I made, and um, inspired by Callie from Frugal Fun Mum. I'm so glad that I could find a markdown like Callie does, so um, <laughs> I'll show you in a minute. And this was my great little markdown by, I don't think I have ever gotten a chicken for $4.80, let alone two. 
Um, I also picked up this roast pork complete with a crackle. So, OMG, I'm in heaven about that. <laughs> So those were my little Coles bargains and I have just um, pulled all the chicken apart. So this one is going to be for like sandwiches and wraps. Um, this one will be for pasta bakes and this is the pork in here. Um, I'm going to um, have some for lunch tomorrow in a sandwich and then I'm going to freeze the rest because I'm the only one that eats it. But I've just put in that for now, um, but the next mission is to... And this is what I'm going to be eating after breakfast. It's like... You're going to be eating that after breakfast? Tomorrow? I don't think so. Way after breakfast, maybe. <laughs> after breakfast, you'll be going to school. It's gummy bears melted and refrozen <laughs> or frozen. So it's frozen gummy bears melted. Maya and Otto made it and it's been in the freezer. <laughs> But my next mission is to get these boys to bed. About three weeks. Yeah, about three weeks ago. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. <laughs> That's what I'm struggling to do now, is get these boys into bed. Wish me luck. <laughs> um, anyway, I... Uh, I need to get my pajamas on. It's late. <sighs> Which I would probably still be in my pajamas, but I literally just got showered and dressed to go to the supermarket well yeah so i've been in my pjs all day so that's why i'm not anyway mm. what look at my hands oh sticky. sticky we need to go wash them <laughs> anyway let's look at them here's the other one <laughs> oscar's behind the camera why do you want to not be in the video there he is <laughs> that was him anyway i'm gonna get these boys into bed and I, and I need clean. to um, restock my cleaning yeah. trolley for Mel's tomorrow. Whoa. Oh. Otto's standing on a pogo stick. Pogo stick. <laughs> That's what he nearly fell off. Anyway, yeah. good night. Happy Friday, almost afternoon. It's 10 past 11 and I have just finished cleaning Mel's house. And I only have one house to do today, so I am done. I am warm as usual. It's, it's not even warm outside. Um, but uh, we'll have the central heating and the water heater going, so that makes it very warm when you're cleaning. Um, anyway, it's nice to be done. Um, I'm not up too much for the day. Um, I don't even know what my height is now. If I'm gonna go straight home. I still actually haven't even quite, without spilling it, I haven't quite finished my coffee from this morning. So, a couple of mouthfuls and I'll be finished uh, with that. Um, bit slack of me. Anyway, um, <laughs> I won't be doing much until I get the boys from school. Um, just uh, staying at home. I might get some washing up because I didn't put any on yesterday. So might do that um, and then in no time it'll be time to pick up the boys from school and then we're watching two games of basketball tonight so um, Maya is playing her very first ever game of basketball and Joseph is playing his first ever game of basketball as well um, it worked out perfectly that they were back to back at the same stadium um, so we'll be able to watch one after the other uh, Maya first at 5, Joseph at 5.50, so excited to that, um, and then two games of basketball to watch tomorrow as well, um, being Otto's first game, so excited, he's so nervous, 8.30am um, is his game, so uh, quarter past 8 we have to be there, and then Oscar is playing, I wouldn't know what number game, probably 19, 20, something like that, 20th game, um, at 1.30 in the afternoon, so a little bit of downtime in between, um, and then that'll pretty much do us for basketball for the weekend, um, I did not, um, update yesterday, but let me have a sip of coffee.
better result than losing, that's for sure. Anyway, I'm really just rambling now, so i am going to make my way home and then, yeah, get some, um, yeah, I do actually need to have a shower and wash my hair because I, um, ugh, I was so overdue for washing my hair, but I just couldn't have bothered, but I um, did wash it this morning. I thought, oh, I will do that, so I'm going to have a shower and wash my hair before I get the boys from school as well. So much exciting things I'm updating you on this morning, but um, cheers to the weekend. Much later in the day, we're arriving at basketball to watch Mia. Good job, We are home from basketball. We watched Maya, we watched Joseph, and then I dropped Oscar at youth. And I come home, I've just cooked butter chicken for tea, and I am searching for my pajamas. Um, I found a pair in here. Uh, these will do. So, <laughs> a tea is waiting for me on the couch. Um, so I'm going to get my pyjamas on, eat it, hopefully I don't spill my tea on there because I've made butter chicken. Um, but it'll be early to bed tonight because Otto's basketball game is 8.30 in the morning. <laughs> so, which means we need to leave home before 8.30, which is earlier than a school morning. So, wish me luck. Now, six days a week getting these boys out of bed. <laughs> anyway, I'll have back up tomorrow. Shane's home, so. Anyway, get my pyjamas on and I'm um, eating my tea. Well, Maya's jumped in her um, Wildcats uniform for the photo, but um, Otto is up for his first game. Um, we're off. On the long <laughs> But anyway, we've got to take a photo of Maya last night, so. Yep. Otto, how are you feeling? Nervous. Nervous? <laughs> You'll be fine, buddy. Get your rebounds, oh. pass it to the other side. Pass, pass it to Will, there you go. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Go, Otto! 
is done and Otto, um, <laughs> Otto um, yeah, had a fun game. He was really good at his defense. Um, <laughs> he got really confused when the goal ends changed, so they all did. Um, but Oscar and I um, have just come to Bunnings because I had a click and collect to pick up, which I'll show you that when I get home. Oh. It's nothing exciting. I probably should just check. What? It's the wrong way. Right. It's just a switch, but I think it's the wrong way. Mm -hmm. Unless they can change this around because it's meant to run that way, but we run ours that way. Anyway, I'm confused. Anyway, um, I'll find enough shade when I get home. They might be out, they might be able to just rotate it. I have no idea. But the reason we had to get this was because um, I'll show you what it does when we get home. But our heat light thing, the switch, the spring must be broken in it. So it won't stay. It does stay on, but it's yeah, it takes forever. Of course, we got a sausage. It's just Oscar and I in the car, so. Just Oscar and I got a sausage and now we are going to the mushroom farm to get <laughs> donuts. <laughs> um, I've got an order of six donuts <laughs> that I need to pick up for other people. My sister and um, she wants two and then I'm getting one for Kerry from, getting four for Kerry from her work. And then we're obviously getting a donut as well. So um, I'm gonna be buying a lot of donuts this morning, but um, we're a little bit early, so we're playing in time with Bunnings and a sausage. So, of course, I've got barbecue sauce and onions. Oh, breakfast of champions, apparently, Oscar said. <laughs> you can see the sheep moving. That's what Oscar does. Close around with the sheep because it's electric. <laughs> anyway, see you when we get donuts. <laughs> This car was parked out at the mushroom farm, so I had to take a video of it because how cool are the colors? either um they're putting permits to actually extend but um yeah it's madness ah uh, got so many donuts because yeah i had to get an extra six donuts on top of like uh, one each for us or so shane and i are going to share to try the new flavors but now we're on our way home and it's a nice little country drive out here but um so many cars coming in and out and there was still another side to the car park and another lot of cars parked down the other side of the road that I didn't show but um 
busy, which is good for them because they're all thinking about closing down. So I think the donuts are drawing people in, but then while you're there, you, um, you're going to buy other things as well. So I did get a couple of things which I'll show you that weren't donuts that are healthy. So I'll show them when I get back, but we need to get back. I'm going to um, have another coffee because my head needs another coffee today. And then we've got to get... <laughs> I had a bed on Marketplace, our old bed from the um, spare room. It's been on Marketplace for some months and um, yeah, somebody messaged and said they would like to buy it. So they're coming to pick it up after 3 o'clock today but uh, we're going to get it out of the shed, out of the back shed and put it into the car garage so it's all ready to go. Just, um, she could come pretty close after we get home from basketball. So that's a little morning update but... Um, I actually have my Ugg boots on. I wore my Ugg boots to basketball this morning because I thought it was going to be so cold in there, but it wasn't too bad. It was actually really, really warm in the car, so the sun is yeah, hot. Anyway, oh, I did quickly speak to Shane. He rang when we were in the Bunnings car park and he said that that switch, the little button's going to be flipped either way, so I didn't get the wrong thing, so. Now we just have to wait for the electrician to come and change it over because it's not just a normal switch, of course. Anyway, home we go. This is probably what Honor is going to do after his basketball oh, game. Let him, oh. <laughs> him, Let him have a nap. <laughs> you still in your basketball gear? <laughs> oh dear. Down Stop annoying him, please, Oscar. Sleep. Oscar probably needs a nap because he's up too early as well. I'm going to sleep on him. <laughs> oh, don't pull his hair. That's what he does. <laughs> Well, somewhere under there, under the million donuts that I got, <laughs> I also got some more of this um, Turkish bread because oh, it was so delicious. <laughs> um, one sweet potato. I think I got four bananas. Yep, four bananas. A piece of pumpkin. Oh, I can get that out. A dollar forty-five for that piece, and some um, cabana to try. shed to get the bed frame out ready and I said to Shane let's just spend five minutes trying to clear all this stuff on the floor here that you can't even see um because things kind of have a spot on the shelf but they're kind of just being dumped anyway I don't even know why we're keeping this leftover bolt from the bolt here anyway <laughs> um, our aim for the second is to get our Christmas tree bag back onto the shelf. It's, has it made it there? <laughs> so. And Oscar was supposed to put this car seat of our loads back in the other car and he didn't. He just dumped it in it. He could have taken two more steps. 
Ticket's in. Oh, it's locked, maybe that's why. <laughs> that's probably why the car's locked, so. All right, I'll let him off on that one. So more suitcases have got to go back in that gap, don't they? I think so. I think. Um, I'll put that there. What's empty in here? Oh, this was just closed. Uh, has that got stuff in it? It's got nothing in it. It's empty. Oh, it's got something in it. photo. What's the photo? Oh. Wow. It shouldn't be left. I box. didn't know it was in there. This is a blast from the past photo. <laughs> it's me, obviously. <laughs> Looking a lot different. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, that was when Shane and I went to Dreamworld to see the tigers, but wow. I used to have, yeah, short spiky hair. And um, it was probably long in that photo. Shane definitely does not want me to go back to that short hairstyle. <laughs> but I'm um, looking a little different these days. <laughs> anyway, that was in that bag, uh, in that box. With this bag, which is a German Shepherd bag. I'll put that in the tubs. Um, oh, should we get that bag out? Behind the Christmas tub there, in that black, pull that Christmas tub out, yep, that one. In that black thing, just put this photo. Yep. Let me just say that. Well, that's an empty box we can use for something. Big box of decorations. Is that already on the shelf? Oh. Do we even want to keep all these? Just probably even for Keep them for like drop sheets or something. We'll leave them for now. <laughs> this was Oscar's when he was little. It's a Sesame Street blanket. We used to have them, I think, on the couch when Rex sat on there. They got all Rex's hair still on them. Anyway, <laughs> um, we're trying to clear a path here. This is what we're trying to do. Um, anyway, <laughs> I'm going to move you over here. I don't know what I'm see. Anyway, it's probably not actually that interesting, so. I was so boring, everyone. And Shane just went and got the keys for the car. And I put the car seat back in and I found um, Otto's blanket. Um, oh, it's got his name on it somewhere. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Otto's blanket. So this has been missing for ages and we had no idea where it was. Um, I thought we might have left it somewhere. But that's where we left it. So it needs a wash. So checking that out the door. Are you sat in the car? Yeah, there. Yeah.
what we have on this car. We, <laughs> Oscar always starts it fairly regularly, but <laughs> we have it on this little trickle charger <laughs> and it gets plugged into the battery, which in this car is in the back. Um, and it just keeps the battery charged. And then we just try and start it however often, once a month or something. But... Well, <laughs> it's better than it was before. I need to decide. Um, Otto is too big for this go-kart thing. Uh, I was gonna give it to Arlo, but I'm thinking I might sell it because, I don't know, Arlo's got so many bikes as well, so. Maybe I might advertise it, take a photo and advertise it and sell it, I reckon. Next minute he ends up out in the box of being over. <laughs> Not bad. Um, that dinosaur's gonna oh, run yeah. out. All right, we, mission complete, we are done. <laughs> All the bed um, has been taken out to the garage. I just need to give it a wipe down before the girl comes, but she's not coming till after three. But I'm gonna get ready for basketball, but I did just get um, Shane to get this box um, of size six clothes down. They were all Oscars. Um, and I just kept them up in the tub. Um, so yeah, Otto will get to wear them because um, he's in desperate need of some um, t-shirts. So hopefully there's some that'll fit him in there. Um, and then all of his clothes I can give to Arlo, so. Um, but yeah, I've got two boxes to go through there, but that's going to be another day. Um, there's a little bit of space on the floor. It still looks chaotic, but if I had shown you what it actually looked like before, <laughs> that was chaotic. Um, uh, making sure I don't have anything else to bring out with me. I'm um, just going to turn the light off in here, but I've now put Otto Oscar's Nitro Circus ramp there, which makes it hard to get to the switch. Um, anyway. Uh, oh gosh, I'm trying to shut the door and change up the chair, chair in front of it. <laughs> I will lock that up, pick this blanket up, take it in and um, give it a wash.
is what I was going to show about our um, switch that keeps flicking off. So if you just go like that one, turns on. Fine. This one. You've got to really <laughs> hold it down. It is so temperamental. It may or may not stay on like that, but that's why we had to get it because it's that different type of switch. We need the electrician to change it over. We're going on a family outing. <laughs> we're going to the laundromat. Yeah. And then we're going to Aldi. How are we going to get tea? Yeah. Oh, oh, hang on, really, really. <laughs> we're just waiting for Oscar. I think we are. Yeah, he's not in. <laughs> just making sure he hadn't snuck in, but um, we are going to have fish and chips for tea. There he comes. Um, but we're going to put the drying at the laundry mat. Going to go across to Aldi. Phone tea. Yeah, I'm just excited because he loves chicken nuggets from the fish shop. Um, <laughs> anyway, um, I. Yeah, that's what we're doing. You just sort it out after I come I did get three loaves of bread and I only got three because that's all that was left. But I've put two in the freezer already. Brioche buns, staple. Garlic bread, we love this one. It's a twin pack. Cheesy stringers, um, Oscar wanted to try these to see if he likes them. Um, burger cheese, it is only limited time so I'm gonna put this one in the freezer. 30 pack of tasty sliced cheese. Tim Tams because they were $2.50. Just two bananas because I um, do have some green ones and I thought we'll need these for Monday school lunches if the ones don't turn ripe. Um, this insect spray, uh, disinfectant wipes. I love these ones because the lid reseals and bin bags. Three tops of butter. These yogurts, my brother got me onto these and he said we couldn't get them here, um, but they've popped up in Aldi. So um, they've got a lot of sugar in them, but they are delicious. So I got two of those. Peanut butter, because it's something we go through that size tub in just over a week and six pack of juices. I'm pretty sure that is all we got at Aldi. Um, so that's the Aldi portion. But, these are the prices. And it was $104.38. I did forget to add these in, but, these um, are for Oscar um, to have at school because I don't normally buy ones like that because they're so expensive, but um, he won't take anything to school. So if you can at least take that, it's something. So um, I got five lots of those for Oscar. Also forgot that I got these T-Rex bites, the one kilo. Um, Otto shows these over chicken fingers. So um, I put them in the freezer, that's why I forgot, but... Happy Sunday. I'm just making coffee, but I was also just unloading the dishwasher. And um, somebody did ask me about my coffee cups, and they are actually Frank Green, all of these ones that we use. Um, 
I, as you know, if you know who, if you've been watching, you know I love leopard prints. So these two would probably be my favorite prints, but I don't actually like drinking out of um, this like stainless steel thing for hot drinks. I think it changes the taste um, of coffee. Um, no, it's done. Um, so I just keep using my old faithful, um, which is a Frank Green, um, but it was a co collaboration with Emmy Lou Loves. That's why it's got a pink love art. So you can't get that anymore. Shades is just a black one. Um, his actually has a chip in the bottom. I don't even know if they use these things, but Frank Green, does mine actually? No, mine doesn't. Um, yeah, Frank Green used to have a thing like a tap and pay back when these cups were really popular and you'd go into certain coffee shops and they'd scan that little chip on the bottom for like your coffee. Anyway, we've never used that um, option and Shane's is like going out of shape. So we probably do need some new ones, but I don't even know if you can get these plastic ones anymore. I need to jump on Frank Green and have a look, um, which I might do once I get these coffees ready. But um, I just thought I would say about that. In case anyone was wondering, um, these are Frank Green. But, um, yeah, I just think it makes the coffee taste a little bit different, not as enjoyable. But I still do use them because I like the prints. Um, anyway, that's my Sunday morning update. Um, other than that, I'm just about to put crumpets on for breakfast. Otto is on the PlayStation, screaming away at everyone already. <laughs> um, but it's 9.19. We're having a slow morning. Happy Sunday. Of course, they actually do come with lids as well. Um, we just don't drink them at home with the lids on because you get the coffee quicker. But this is what type of lid they come with. Just a little push button one. So you just drink out of that spout. And they are pretty good at not being spill proof as well. So that's the lids for them. <laughs> I'm just going to put them up in the cupboard up here. Um, that's obviously my pink lid up there. And Shane's... Oh, Shane's coffee cup has a black lid, which lives on the coffee machine <laughs> behind these things that I have on there. Uh, this is actually coffee wax melts. It smells like coffee in there. And this is one of Otto's little things that he gave me to put on the coffee machine. Um, star bath coffee. It's out of his gross minis. <laughs> Package. All right, have in your seat. <laughs> We're going to Pam's for tea. I don't know. That's how you do it. <laughs> yeah, you have to push down on it. Yes. Now get snow. I mean, get Ella. That's everybody. Oh, I didn't see anyone else there. <laughs> Bumbles. Snow. <laughs> Right in the back. <laughs> I, just throw, I don't know who I throw in the back. Oh, don't climb over that way. Um, right, quick, so we'll get to Pam's. Oh, I did over sit. Come on. Why here on my hair? Hurts. Because he's always pulling on it. I'll pop the charger, buddy. I'll pop the charger. When I was just laying in his bed and he fell went back. I remember. The vlog probably remembers because I was filming. <laughs> no, not my hair. No. Like my head. Yeah. Uh, we are off to Pam's for tea, so that's the most exciting thing of the day. <laughs> We've literally done nothing. Lotto's in his PJs. He like being on the vlog, yes, Oscar doesn't. So because look at him. Yeah, he's not he's there but he's not there. <laughs> anyway, to Pam's we go. Actually, we're gonna go get my dad's tea first and then drop it to my dad. Um, um, yeah, we've got to go and drop my dad's tea to him first. So I've got to go to KFC, pick up his tea, drop it to him, and then we'll go to Pam's. KFC! <laughs> Help me out, 
home from Pam in my PJs. My heat bag has been heated up. So only two things left to do. One, end the vlog. Two, go to bed. So <laughs> time to end the vlog. Thanks for joining me this week. As always, I will see you next week. Until then, enjoy the simple things in life. Goodbye.